Hi friends, my name is Rohan Balachandra. Welcome to today's breaking news where we cover the finance and economic news of the country. News number one, Indian market best performing. I have put a very interesting table where it shows the returns of various markets in 2022 so far. World markets average 19.4% that means negative 19.4% and USA almost 21% down, China almost 19% down in 2022, Japan 23% down, Hong Kong 17% down, UK 25% down, Germany almost 35% down and Indian markets just about 1% down in the entire 2022 so far. So the performance has been very good even in 2020 and 21 we were one of the best performing stock markets in the world. News number 2 Mahindra Mahindra second most valuable auto company. Shares of Mahindra Mahindra has overtaken Tata Motors in terms of market capitalization to become the second most valued auto company in India. Mahindra Mahindra has a market cap of around 1.64 lakh crores whereas Tata Motors has a market cap of 1.58 lakh crores. Maruti Suzuki continues to be the most valued auto firm with a market cap of Rs 2.66 lakh crores. News number 3 Vodafone Ideas Dues Conversion to Shares The Finance Ministry has cleared a proposal to convert Vodafone Ideas Dues Rs 16,130 crores to the government into stake in Vodafone Idea Company. Now the Telecom Department has to finalize the transaction as per the telecom package announced earlier. After the transaction, government may hold around 33% stake in the company and in future when the share price goes up, they will sell it to some other investors at a profit. News number 4, Rapid News. Yes Bank shares at a 20 month high of Rs 17.8 on the expectation of better performance in the coming quarters. And Adani will make an open offer to purchase additional 26% stake in NDTV from October 17th to November 1st. The price will be Rs 294 per share whereas the current price of NDTV is Rs 464. So not sure who will be ready to sell at 294 when the market rate itself is much higher. Now moving on to today's stock market update. Nifty went up by 174 points and closed at 17,799, 0.99% up. Sensex went up by 659 points and closed at 59,688. Point number 2. Today's top Nifty 50 gainers and losers. Shri Simmons top gainer 5.51% up, BPCL 3.98% up, Axis Bank 3.22% up, Tech Mahindra 3.2% up. Top losers Hindalco 2.84% down, Tata Steel 1.63% down, SBI Life Insurance 1.04% down, Coal India round 1% down. Point number 3 Today's top Nifty Next 50 gainers and losers. Top gainers Vajaj Holdings. 10.3% up, Zomato 3.11% up, Bank of Baroda 3.09% up, Ambuja Simmons 2.9% up. Top losers, Gland Pharma 1.91% down, Interglobe Aviation 1.87% down, ICICI Lombard 1.65% down, Pyramid Enterprises 1.61% down. Point number 4, Advanced Decline Ratio for NSE, Advances 1,203 stocks, Declining 775 stocks, so 61% up, 39% down. Point number 5 Yesterday's FII and DII investment data. Foreign institution investors net purchase 758 crores worth of shares. Domestic institution investors net sales were 139 crores worth of shares. Point number 6 Today's gold and silver price. Gold price 4670 per gram, silver 59.5 per gram. Point number 7 Today's rupee value. 1 US dollar 79.71, 1 euro 79.77 rupees. Point number 8 Stocks near 52 week high. Adani Enterprises 52 week high 3501, closing price 3463. Ambuja Cements 464, 52 week high, closing 462. ICICI Bank 52 week high 900, closing price 899. Mahindra Mahindra 1332, 52 week high, closing 1322. Point number 9 Stocks near 52 week low. No major stock touched as new 52 week low today. Point number 10 Global queues today. Hong Kong 1% down. Japan 2.31% up. 
Germany 0.27% down, France 0.34% up, UK 0.24% up and Nasdaq yesterday 2.14% up. So this was today's breaking news. If this video was good, please click the like button and if this video was informative, please type I or informative in the comment section. Thank you for watching this video. Bye bye and all the best.